So hey guys, let's talk about weeds. So I'm in my uh, lawn right now, and this is a little embarrassing, but this thing, let's see if I can get you a full look at this massive thing. That thing right there is a weed, right? This ginormous thing that is not meant to be there. And um, the thing about it that's crazy to me is that it hasn't really rained that much. And my grass is kind of low and everything, but then all of a sudden, all over the grass, there's pops up these weeds. And these weeds can grow as huge as this one. And the thing is, they don't need as much water. And whenever they take root, they start to eat and take away from the plants around them. And so that's what makes it a weed. And so whenever I was thinking about this, I was like, we have weeds in our own lives. And, you know, we have these things that... They don't need they don't need water, right? They don't need um, all this extra. They just need enough to be able to infiltrate. And then we are sitting here trying to grow these good um, these good uh, grass and the good plants. And all of a sudden, you know, like these weeds start to take over. And what it does, as you look over here, I've got another weed, right, on my tree, and it starts to suffocate. This vine is starting to suffocate. This good plant that's here on purpose and so if we are careful then there's going to be weeds in our life that are trying to suck away all the life that they can that that is trying to be brought forth into our life so how do we identify weeds right well weeds don't need a lot of a lot of water and if you think about it Jesus says that he is the fountain of living water. And so whenever we are looking at our weeds in our life, we have to ask ourselves, is this something that whenever I'm drawing closer to God, is this something that thrives or is this something that, that doesn't have the room anymore? You know, because all the good uh, plants have taken up all that water to suck it in. And by sucking in the good water, it doesn't. It leaves those roots nice and strong. That well, I don't have space for this weed. Um, it doesn't have the ability to get in and infiltrate anymore. Is it? And you know, you can also ask yourself: Is it sucking life away from you? Because if it's sucking life away from you and your other plants around you, the things that are good, then it's a weed. No matter what it looks like. We can have a lot of grass in our yard that looks like grass, but it's not grass because it's a weed. It's stealing from everything else around. We've got different weeds that look like flowers and different things. Those things aren't helpful if they're going in and sucking life away from everything else around it. So start to look at your life and start to ask yourself, hey, is this a weed? Are these things in my life, are they sucking away the life that I'm supposed to have? Or is it something that is actually the fruit of the life and the water that's flowing through my life? Have a great week, guys.